And now we have some fantastic clothes here, but what are you going to speak to us today about, Cynthia? Okay. First of all, I'd like to say hi, and I missed you. I missed <laughs> you, <laughs> Dami. <laughs> Good to be back. Um, well, today I just wanted to say a quick uh, word about Fashion Week. We're into mm. London uh, Fashion Week this week. We've just come off of New York Fashion Week, and of course, um, the Fashion Weeks are looking at the collections for Spring Summer 15, so right. they're actually looking already at what we'll wear in the future. And um, the collections that we see actually in the magazines now, Autumn Winter 14, were actually at the London Fashion Weeks and the you know, New York Fashion Weeks uh, back in February. Mm -hmm. So just a quick recap of uh, New York Fashion Week. Um, your American designers mainly, and uh, the shows that I would, uh, are worth checking out, I think, uh, Marc Jacobs for sure with the military uh, luxury chic. Of course, uh, you always have uh, the fabulous, you know, Donna Karen shows and then uh, Nicole Miller and all that. Mm. Um, in addition, though, Fashion Week has always been about looking at established designers' collections, but it's also yeah. about showcasing and finding new talent. Mm -hmm. And uh, I just wanted to talk about uh, an up-and-coming designer that's from the town I'm in, actually, North Battleford, Saskatchewan. And I just have a few slides to go through, and then okay. we can maybe go through the clothes. Can't wait to go through these. Yeah, awesome. go ahead. Slides. Okay. <laughs> so the first slide here, um, basically, this is uh, Jonte Khan. So this is the designer that has made all the clothes on the rails and me and my sister's dresses today. And it's from North Battleford. And you might wonder, where is North Battleford, Saskatchewan, <laughs> right? <laughs> uh, check out the green right in the middle there. And uh, you can see Regina there. We're just, uh, we are west, northwest of there, a couple mm -hmm. hours still. So okay. you can see that we're very far from Toronto. Everyone always asks if we're from <laughs> Toronto. Uh, the next slides, though. Uh, basically are just showing his creative process. Now, this uh, young designer is actually only 17 years old. Wow. He, yeah, he started when he was 14 and you can see his drawings here. Uh, the next s couple slides sort of show his uh, more of the creative process. So he's finishing the illustrations. Mm. This is where he's getting his inspiration. He's so talented. Mm -hmm. It's amazing. Isn't that mm -hmm. lovely? Really? Yeah. The next yeah, one's I think take you through the work that he's done here. So these are just some of the inspirations that he takes from magazines and he's always looking mm -hmm. at fashion shows and drawing on that, you know, for his creativity. Um, the next two slides I think show um, his actual work process. So these are some of his dresses in the so early stages. You've identified the one, Chrissy, that is the one. And the next one there, we'll show that one in a second. So right on. And just showing some of his processes and how the garments are created. And you've got to keep in mind, this is a 17-year-old boy doing this in his mm. bedroom. Like, literally, it's amazing. no training. He's going to be huge. I yeah. think so. Someone's <laughs> got to endorse this guy. <laughs> so, basically, he told me that the first time he's ever made a garment was he found this, like, shirt pattern mm -hmm. in a book. And it just started from wow. there. And his love for these fashion shows that are going on right uh -huh. now and stuff. So, I think I have a few more slides here. Um, these are just some of the paintings he does. The next one as well are just some of the paintings he does. He is the son of an artist. His father, Jeff Kahn, is um, an artist in New mm -hmm. Mexico. So wow. that's some of the things he does. And I think the last slide here is just another shot of, of Jonte. So, oh, actually that one is, he, <laughs> those are two of his designs he designed for me, myself and Megan last London Fashion Week. We okay. wore that to the glass party. So you can see the detailing wow. in that. That's oh, Jonte there. there. Yeah, Good so on there's Jonte. Hello. And thank you <laughs> for all the dresses. <laughs> And uh, yeah, I guess I'll just is go it? through them now. Okay, great. Um, I'd like to actually start with what you're wearing. Yours is the only dress that isn't actually Jonte's creation, but I really went for that New York sort of dinner party, going to eat a uh, hamburger very chic-like in New York City. So we have some American designers on Chrissy today. We have her in a Nadia Tarr monochrome dress paired with some Sam Edelman shoes. Now these are two American designers. So Chrissy's okay. ready to go have a <laughs> awesome burger and fries dinner like Sex and the City's uh, lunch date. And we've just did a very New York chic look in lieu of uh, New York Fashion mm -hmm. Weekend. And on my sister here, I guess I'll talk about hers. This uh, dress is also from Jonte Khan. And this one was very inspired by Iris Van Herp. And I've paired it with the Lucy Choi heel. But he actually is most proud of this garment because he said that he's starting to take into account how to pin the fabric and the organza to That's a woman's amazing. curves. Mm -hmm. Very, very cool. Mm -hmm. um, with this dress that I'm wearing today, I've actually uh, told him how I'm loving this 1960s look uh, that's trending right now. So basically he's done a shift dress with sort of a bell sleeve, uh, very merry quaint, very um, 
you know, just very 1960s. Mm -hmm. I'm just loving it. And also the garment itself actually has a second purpose. If you take a look, it now can transform into sort of so a different cool. garment. <laughs> Cape, so yeah. keep in mind, this kid is 17 years old and yes. Cynthia, would you Easy. believe it's time for a break? We is run it? out of time. Okay, well, we'll talk about the break. However, <laughs> don't go anywhere. <laughs> Because we're going to take up a bit of time from the final part of the show to go through this. Because we, we cannot finish the show without going through these lovely garments, can we? Or tripping on them. Or tripping. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so do join us after this break. Okay. So, as we heard before the break, these were all made, handmade. All of these handmade. And everything by a 17-year-old designer. Yeah, so just this dress right here is one of the ones he's proud of because he said that this waterfall dress that is very inspired by Alexander McQueen, who is one of his main inspirations, it's just he, he saw the quality starting to come together in the garments. And you can see this one here. Sorry, let's see the detail. On sure, this sure, one. sure. On this yeah. one. Let's take a look. Can we get a close up of the, of the detail? That one looks. You can see he's using sort of the mesh fabric that was very yeah. popular at the Dior Couture shows that last couple seasons and mm -hmm. such. So amazing, isn't yeah, it, Chrissy? It's like, wonderful. really? Like, I don't know if I could ever make something like this if I was forced to. <laughs> but um, here are just a, a couple other ones uh, that he's put to these together. And just to give you a bit of a timeline, like he, he put these together just as I got back to Canada. I've only been gone three weeks. And here is. I can't two, believe he's done all this in such a short space of time. This one was the one in, in the photo. Um, right. Yeah. But that last one, Chrissy, if you just take that one off the hanger, that's the one that I just think is the most striking. This one is amazing. This was actually one of the pictures, wasn't it? Two of the pictures. Yeah, of the, the ones that were being assembled. Can we assembled. get a close up of the design? Absolutely. That. Each one of those flowers are put together by hand by individual feathers and pearls with a glue gun. So you can just that's imagine amazing. the labor that's gone into that. And he was very inspired by um, Miu Miu Prada with that. And you're the only one with this dress. I Cynthia. love that. I was very lucky that's to so have amazing. found this young couture for for myself so uh like i said watch for that name like take on should try that one should <laughs> <Absolutely. laughs> very beautiful anyways that's okay. it for today so we wish him all the best with his designs because he is amazing he's going to be huge i'm sure absolutely he's thank coming you, to then. london oh to is he definitely going to have him so. on the show then. Okay. awesome that's definitely cool. all right okay. thank you so much Cynthia. we'll see you again next, see you week. next week so now it's over to excel my darling.